great honor. So first because it's, you know, best young researcher, so I feel young, so that's, you know, excellent. And it's very, very flattering. So the list of, you know, past laureates is a group of excellent researchers. Many of them are actually friends or even uh, colleagues. So being part of this, of this group is, is an incredible honor. And so I'm very, very happy today. My main fields of research are the regulation of banks and banking economics in general, and also market microstructures, so the functioning of financial markets, stock exchanges, over-the-counter markets, and you know, trading mechanisms, so trying to understand how people you know, trade financial assets in general. The work I do is mostly theoretical work. So what I do is that I build theoretical models using, for instance, uh, microeconomics, in which we try to model the behavior of market participants, how they interact with each other, the type of process this generates, and we try to see whether this explains what we see you know, in the data. So we have a lot of financial data, a lot of prices, a lot of volumes, a lot of non-standard data of all sorts. And so, you know, the number of data sets that we consider in finance is increasing all the time. And I think that we really need theoretical guidance, you know, to understand what kind of behavior can lead to the observations that we have empirically. And so just to give you a practical example uh, of the type of research I'm doing, at the moment, I work on a project in which we build um, machine learning algorithms that interact on an artificial financial market. So we let them interact together. This leads to some trades, to some prices, and sometimes it leads to some types of unexpected behavior. And we try to see whether this type of behavior is also something that we observe in financial markets. Do we observe mini flash crashes, for instance? Do, do we observe episodes of extreme volatility? Do we observe uh, episodes in which there is very little liquidity on the market? And so ultimately, the goal is you know, to try to compare the reality, the empirical reality, to processes that we understand much better because they are based on models. And so basically, can we simplify reality and extract from it something that we understand a bit better because it's based on a theoretical model. And so that's the type of research I do.